Good morning everyone. This is Dr. Richa from the Department of English, Patna Women's College and today I will be discussing a few very important concepts related to commodity and media such as use value, exchange value, symbolic value, sign value and hyperreality. Coming to use value, use value is the value of a thing based on its usability or need. For instance, a packet of rice has a high use value with respect to hunger. Similarly, books have high use value with reference to education, whereas exchange value is the value of thing based on its availability or market value. For instance, a diamond necklace has a greater exchange value than a packet of rice, although rice is more useful than diamond, at least with reference to hunger. We can certainly not eat diamond or gold when we are hungry and many of us may even survive without it. Now coming to symbolic value. Symbolic value is the value of a thing based on the symbol it is associated with. For instance, birthday gift or a birthday cake or an engagement ring have symbolic value. It may not have any use or exchange value. Chocolates on chocolate day and a teddy bear on a teddy day has certainly more value than on any other day. Sign value is the value of the sign and it can be very powerful without much of a use or exchange or even symbolic value. Some examples are the sign of a logo of reputed brands like Gucci or Audi or Levi, sign code of roll number, PAN number, Aadhaar number, binary code and many more. So, Baudry Laad has analyzed the sign value and its impact dependent, independent of any other value. It produces multiple images without any original and hence we live amid copies of copies without an original. And this leads to another topic, hyperreality. Hyperreality is a state of reality where it is almost impossible to distinguish between the real and the imitation of the real. In this state, more often reality appears to be more real than real itself. This usually happens with the use of multimedia where the distinction between fake and real is blurred and images are reproduced in their multiple copies. This is affected mostly by medium. Medium is the message, is a phrase. This phrase was originally given by McLuhan. Since the world we live in is, uh, is more about sign value and therefore the medium becomes the message. It is not the value of the message that is important, but the sign value of the medium becomes more important. The society has changed with every changing medium of communication. From oral tradition to written words to radio to television set, our culture has changed along with the medium of message. In the times of internet, it is the web that conveys multiple messages and those messages are reproduced again and again. Message means anything that is conveyed through a medium including words, images, live shows, poetry, TV serials and many more. And there is proliferation of images. There is a rapid increase in the production of message and Baudrillard uses the pathological analogy of cancer. Like cancer cells, the message spreads rapidly till the field of the medium is saturated. Communication process is considered to be complete when the interaction takes place between the sender and the receiver. But because of proliferation of images, communication suffers a great deal. Most of the time, messages are generated to keep the medium active, for example, repeat telecast, news channels, etc. They keep floating images so, so much that there is hardly any communication. The work of art loses its aura, its depth with such prolifer uh, proliferation of images. A painting, a poem, a documentary and many such art forms are fused into one medium, one screen and the screen that is the medium of the message overpowers the message.